Japanese paper Nikkei Asia ranked the Philippines 121st out of 121 countries in its latest COVID-19 overall. The health department took issue saying it was just a timing thing. During this time in September, dito po talaga tumaas sa mga kaso dito sa ating bansa. So they compared ito pong pagtaas natin or infection rate when in fact hindi pare-pareho po ang time periods ng pagtaas ng kaso sa bawat bansa. The Nikkei pointed out that the Philippines still had one of the lowest vaccination rates at 30 percent wide. Yun atin pong pagbabakuna, naging erratic din po iyan this September because of the supplies, of course. Tinignan natin yung access. The Nikkei rating comes a week after the country also placed last in Bloomberg's COVID-19 resilience ranking. The Philippines was described as the worst place to be during the pandemic. When asked about the Bloomberg rate, how much of the economy has reopened, which isn't quite accurate. Ang tinitignan nila, paano nakakabalik na sa dati ang ekonomiya. At syempre, habang nagla-lockdown, hindi po mangyayari na makakabalik tayo sa dati. The granular lockdown system in Metro Manila has been extended to October 15. The IATF also recently expanded the vaccination program to adolescents aged 12 to 17 to begin next week. Mobile journalist Pamela Vasquez, We Are One News.